Hi and welcome to Top 10. As we all know that Turkish drama attracts a lot of attention not just in Turkey but also in the world as well. It is an indisputable fact that Turkey offers a lot of series to the world. That's why in this video we are going to count down top 7 Turkish drama series that gone too soon. Before we jump in if you stay one more second please hit the like and subscribe button and thank you for your kind support. Back to our video top 7 Turkish drama series that gone too soon. Let's get started. Number 7 Baba name Gunalari Baba Nim Gunalari drama series was podcast by Kadir Doğlu who played the role of Ozan and Melissa Suzanne who played the role of Yasin. The story of Baba Nim Gunalari is about a loving father who vowed to live on for his child. Almost every parent does everything possible to make his child happy, but there are only few who have managed to come to the terms with that. promising no matter what to fight to end for the welfare of their blood ozan who is young and handsome man who by coincidence become a prisoner and he had to take the guilt of another person otherwise the story could be end badly because ozan's woman was in danger number 5 servet Servet drama series was podcast by Yusuf Chem who played the role of Jan Yegit and Bahar Sen who played the role of Fera. The one thing that can be called the real fortune in the real world where everybody fortune is pursuing that is a story about love. Fera was one of the thousand of young people that had to fill the age of 18 years and have lived their dream. But there was an important difference from other. She was not alone. She has a great family, yet she doesn't even know. And she was so rich that she could not even imagine. Jan Yegut on the other hand was a 29 years old, just like Fera. He had lost his parents. He grew up like a child, but under the wings of an important businessman around the country. Country. He was able to do whatever he wanted. John and Vera stayed in the middle of fight, made for huge fortune that cannot be shared. Number four, Eight Gun. Eight Gun drama series was podcast by Birchu Birche who played the role of Bahar and Yegit who played the role of Ahmed. The drama series revolves around Bahar, who is beautiful young woman. who has everything in his life a lovely husband and a wealthy life she live happily with her husband exciting with her first baby her perfect life turned upside down in one day that her mother sena who work as a software engineer in a prestigious company is announced to die in an airplane crash nobody find the airplane and dead bodies yet hence bahar does not believe her mother is dead in this drama series you will explore how perfect life of bahar changes dramatically when her mother disappear mysteriously will she manage to survive and unveil the mystery behind her mother disappearance who knows find out Number 3 Dari Si Basimiza It is a comedy and romantic based Turkish drama series and is podcast by Ozan Dolone who play the role of Ozan and Ele Dogan who play the role of Oiku The story revolves around a colorful love story that began with the misunderstanding of handsome genius that she has encountered with a young woman who is deceived by a man she made marriage plans with Number 2 Vurgun Vurgun drama series was podcast by Erkan Pitikaya who played the role of Kemal and Deniz Kakar who played the role of Rehan Vurgun is a Turkish internet series produced by Bubble Picture the first season of this drama series premiered on 2019 The story of Vurgun follows the life of Ali Kemal who 10 years ago survived a fire that occurred in the factory How would Ali Kemal react to his new reality having been in coma for 10 years who knows find out Number 1 Azize aka the Sane the drama series revolves around Hande Ersoy who play the role of Azize 
and the series follow Melek who is young nurse with the destroyed family her father who is successful captain was killed by mafia family orphan family when she was a little girl she grew up in a difficult condition and planned to revenge for those who killed her father and condemned her mother into mental hospital and she want to destroy all her life she also disclose her true identity and change her name to Azize The story of Aziza tell us about passionate but impossible love story. So guys, these are the top 7 true drama series that gone too soon and that you must watch with English subtitle. At the end I will say that don't hesitate to vote as which one is your favorite true drama series and how many series you have watched from this list. Let me know this in the comment section. And if you are new to our channel, please hit the like, subscribe and share this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around.